Hi, I'm Lindsay, and this is your weekly news update from Open Media. How would you feel about a model of internet governance that puts the power in the hands of the world's most repressive regimes? Not great, right? Well, I wish I had better news. A little-known UN agency called the ITU has been angling for control of internet governance, and it is doing it in what I can only imagine is the worst possible way. Their plan will give big telecom giants and repressive regimes the power to make the internet more expensive, surveilled, and censored. And of course, there's also the lack of transparency around the process. At this point, you're probably thinking, oh, come on, another threat to our digital future? Aren't we, you know, done? The short answer is no, we're not. And not only that, the ITU's proposal puts openness, innovation, affordability, and don't forget our rights on the line in a crazier, higher level way than ever before. So here's the plan. We've pushed back against threats like this before, and we've turned heads, and we've even won. A lot, actually. So we're using similar tactics now, using the internet to save the internet, but we're going big. Check it out. Open Media has joined a growing coalition of internet freedom groups, civil society, and citizens around the world in launching the site at protectinternetfreedom.net. It is so awesome, in fact, that before the site was even officially launched this week, thousands had found it, signed on, and spread the word. And that's exactly what I'm asking you to do now at protectinternetfreedom.net. Decision makers can't, won't, ignore a groundswell of dissent. And as the December round of negotiations approaches, we're only going to get louder. So if you are watching this, you are positioned to be a first responder. Your job is to give this campaign a running start, and we're counting on you. So visit, I'll say it one more time, protectinternetfreedom.net. Learn more and make your voice heard as part of the internet freedom movement. For the internet, this is Lindsay with Open Media, signing off.